What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the Juice React video. In today's video, we are reacting to Hell of a Boss, the pilot. Now this was dropped in my Discord. So again, if you guys have not joined the Discord, you should do that. Link is in the description. It is free. And if you want to drop links to actual videos you want me to react to, you should definitely go do that. It's one of the good reasons to join. And of course, it's the best place to reach and talk to me if you guys want to just hang out. But yes, today we are reacting to Hell of a Boss, the pilot episode. I believe this is a series. Uh, this was recommended to me on my stream and then it was put in my Discord. So yeah, we're going to dive into this. I don't know what to expect. It looks like it's an animation. You know I love reacting to animations. So let's dive right into it. Let's do this. Cartoon is for adults. Ooh, I love adults. All right, now I know business has been a bit slow lately. Yes, it's no one's fault, okay? I'm not naming any names here. Moxie. Now, does anyone have <laughs> any bright ideas on how we can get business drumming up again? What about a car wash? This is hell, Millie. No one cares about cars being clean here, okay? Whoa, what about a billboard? We can't afford a billboard, sir. Helpful, Moxie. Really glad you're in the room right now. Have you guys forgotten oh. what service we provide? Got him. Good times. I don't need any reminding, sir, considering you blew most of our salaries on an obnoxious TV ad last week. One that you then additionally paid to have run for a full three hours on a channel nobody watches. Uh, hey, excuse me. What's obnoxious about a super fun jingle, all right? It's a fun distraction when an advertisement's spitting bullshit. People love musicals, sir. Exactly, Millie. And we're basically doing a musical. Are you gonna crush my musical theater dreams like my dad did? Sir? Because <laughs> right now, all I see is just my dad's asshole talking to me, crushing my dreams of being who I truly am inside. Good animation. Are you trying to crush his dreams, Moxie? I... what? I thought I knew you. I can't believe you, Moxie, after I made you employee of the month. Okay, sir. I'm sorry. A commercial jingle is not comparable to musical theater. Nobody actually likes the jingles. I liked it. Do not, do not agree with him in front of me. Hi there, I'm Blitz. The O is silent, and I am the founder of IMP. Are you a piece of shit who got yourself <laughs> sent to hell, or are you an innocent soul who got fucked over by someone else? After lovingly killing my wife for fucking the delivery man, you can imagine my surprise when I wound up here after the state Ohio. of Ohio killed me. I really wish I could stick it to that yappy jobber who saw me hiding the body. Well, luckily for you, thanks to our company's special access to the living world, we can help you take care of your unfinished business by taking out anyone who screwed you over when you were alive. When you want somebody gone and you don't want to wait too long, call the immediate murder professionals. And grenade or cyanide will make it look like suicide. The immediate murder professionals. We do our job so well because we come straight up from hell. We'll kill your husband or your wife, we'll even let you keep the knife for the immediate murder profession. Hell yeah. Doctor, he's not responding. Oh, what a stat. I didn't do anything. Damn it. I'm not losing another one. Clear! <laughs> Holy shit, it actually worked. He appears to be in stable condition, but he'll need surgery. Now, what insurance provider do you freaks have? The fuck is insurance? <laughs> Kids die for free! I'd like to go on record and say that incident was Luna's fault. Dispatch is supposed to give us the right info on the target. It's very simple. Oh, sit on a dick, Moxie. You sit! Sit on a... and the... D do your job! Hey, now we don't blame our screw-ups on Luna, okay? She didn't do anything wrong. <laughs> Are you kidding me, sir? She's awful. Hello, Furries IMP. Where have I got stabbed? Go on. Happy adoption anniversary, Looney. I got you a little something. Is it a cure for syphilis? I... Oh. Then I don't want it! I'm sorry, the spiders. God damn it. Uh, excuse me. Did you just fax me an ad for weight loss? No. What? Why? Why would anyone send me this? Come on. You know why. 
Whoever left the fucking avocado salad in the fridge, I'm taking it because I have the worst hangover right now. Why would you drink on a work night? I'm hungover from this morning, dumbass. Isn't that my lunch? You know what? I can't take this assault right now. I need to blow off some fucking steam. <laughs> Blitz, that clingy rich asshole is on the phone, says it's urgent, wants to talk to you. He sounds a little dtf -y. Oh, God, it was one <laughs> time! If I hadn't slept with that privileged asshole, none of us would have access to the living world. You what? Got the buck, got the buck. Got this fucking heavy buck. Ugh. Oh, oh, shit! <laughs> Sorry, I fucked your husband. I heard you already! <laughs> oh, what can I do you for this time, Stolas? There's a political candidate causing trouble up on Earth for a few of my associates. He's trying to convince people global warming exists. Doesn't it? Well, yes, but more people die if nothing is done about it. And it gets lonely here. <laughs> okay, well, yeah, that makes sense. You know what happens when I'm lonely, Blitzy? Oh, God, oh, fucking God. Damn it. When I'm lonely, I become hungry. And when I become hungry, I want to choke on that red <laughs> of yours. <laughs> your salad and lick all of your <laughs> before taking out your <laughs> and <laughs> with more teeth until you're screaming <laughs> like a fucking baby. <laughs> Eat this. And then you know that bridge over the freeway? Yeah? Shit off it. Look, the point is, Luna is a valued member of our family, and we don't get rid of family. We aren't a family, sir. You are the boss. We are the employees. You treat her like she's some troubled teenager. She's more like a meth-addicted homeless woman you let man the phones. That is offensive. Without homeless people, I wouldn't have half the joy and laughter I do in this life. While we are on the subject of Family, can you stop finding me and Millie outside of work? Come on, sweetie, it's not that big a deal. Excuse me. What? Honey, can you give me the butter? Sir, sweetie. Oh, they're married? Spoiler alert, the butter's spoiled. <laughs> What's funny, honey? Really impressive wordplay. What the? Why are you in our fridge? <laughs> I did not know they were married. What you dreaming about? I was dreaming my parents were being murdered. But now, I'd like to go back to that. Of all the is in hell, it's for him that I fell. Oh, Millie. Are you fucking filming us right now? <laughs> Just stop doing that. I don't see what the issue is. Is there something you don't want me seeing? No. You a baby wiener haver? Sir, what you say and how you act is totally inappropriate! Calm down, Mox. You're gonna have another panic attack! I am calm! Oh, relatable. They're there. Relatable. Look, I don't judge the boring couple stuff you do outside of work hours, so don't judge me. Oh, I do judge you, sir. Quite a lot, actually. Mox, he's our boss! No, 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 it's fine, Mills. Your husband is just, how do I say this without being offensive? Retarded. Does immaturely insulting me make you feel better about your sad, single life? It actually does. The only reason you have a wife is because you're easy to manage. No, he's not, you bitch! Do not talk to my receptionist that way. She's sensitive. Yes, I am! You guys are all fucking assholes. <laughs> oh, shut up, kid. You're lucky to witness this. Ugh, this company is such a mess. All right, let's get back to talking about my outfit. Nobody was talking about that. Which is why I'm trying to get that ball rolling. So how does it look? It's good, right? It's been a literal hell having to pretend to be paralyzed so you fuck shits wouldn't kill me. But now I want that. I want death. <laughs> you are a selfish, greedy clown. And I'm a kid. We're supposed to like clowns. Even the creepy ones. Hey now, that's not very... If I wanted to hear from a spineless jackass, I'd rip out your spine and ask you some shit. That's my husband you're talking to! <laughs> that's your husband? I figured you for a slut, but I didn't know you needed dick that bad. And you... <laughs> what? What about me? Nothing. I don't talk to dogs. I'm a cat person. Wow. Oh, you know, kid, you kind of are a piece of shit. Yeah, yeah. I... He is good. Yeah. Oh, fuck. 
Guys, I just got a text from our client. Guess he was the right target after all. Who? Him. Me? Yep. They wanted us to kill an actual child. That's what they're saying. Well, Christ on a stick, I guess there is a god. <laughs> you know, folks, with this company, I really wanted to prove that we're yeah. capable of doing the same things anyone else can. Like killing people. So from us here at the Immediate Murder Professionals Group, we promise to settle your unfinished business or your money is gone and you're never getting it back and you can write us a bad review, but we'll play dumb to it because it's hell and no one fucking cares. You know, even though this that kid was, awesome. was a target, he's still a child. It's important that we handle this going forward respectfully. Please, if anyone has seen my little Eddie, please <laughs> contact us and fall! <laughs> You're welcome! Oh, what a thrill when the crimson starts to spill. Huh. And my mi That's pretty funny. That was, that was for one really well animated. I'm not gonna lie. The animation was solid. Like, that, I feel like you could have easily made that, that could easily be like a series on something. Because the animation was smooth as fuck. How old is this series? So this is the pilot. Um, then there's, I guess this is a different show, Bad Luck Jack, Hell of a Boss, Season 1, Episode 1, uh, Surprise Hell of a Signing Stream? Or, I don't know what that is. So, we got Episode 2, then there's Season 1 Trailer, Episode 3, Episode 4. So, there's actually four episodes of this, and then it looks like they have other shows out there. Which, uh, I find a hell of a... He hell of a... I'm kind of interested in this other one. It looks creepy as hell. I like their art designs. They got some really cool designs. Uh, if there's any other videos I should check out, let me know. It looks like they have a bunch of different things that could be reacted to. It seems like they have a lot of speed drawing stuff, which is interesting. But it looks like they're actually creating content as well. But, uh, they have 5 million subscribers, so this looks like a pretty popular channel. And they get hella views on stuff. But... Yeah, the Hell of a Boss is uh, really good. That was awesome. So yeah, if you guys have any other reactions or things that I should check out, you can go leave them in the Discord, or you can go ahead and uh, just, you know, leave a comment in the comment section down below as, as well. But that is going to be it, ladies and gentlemen. Of course, you can come hang out on the Twitch stream if you want to do that later today, if you're watching this on the day this was uploaded. But if not, go hit that follow button so you know when we go live. But that's going to be it, ladies and gentlemen. As always, I am your host, Juicebox. Remember to wake up in the morning and ask yourself something. I'm a daily dose of juice. See you guys next time.